I have long observed the lands between. This world is in dire need of repair and death. Indiscriminate. Are you prepared to commit a cardinal sin? Very well. Let my hand rest upon you. For but a moment. O Erd Tree, you shall burn. Burn for the sake of the new Lord. Thank you for guiding me here. The one who walks alongside flame shall one day meet the road of destined death. Goodbye. What use do you have for me now? I am a finger reader. I will remain here until their dialogue ends and the fingers speak again. Do as you please. Take whatever course seems most worthy to you. Now you may go. <laughs> You'd force this tired old crone to work, even now. 
Ah, harder taskmaster have I never met. Take a look around. The round table hold is burned. Raised to the ground. Don't worry. I don't blame you. I'll continue spirit tuning just the same as before. Which is why I need your help persuading Master Hugh to leave. His roots are so knotted in this place. He won't last much longer if he stays here. His shackles are broken. He's a free man now. It's high time he put the round table behind him. Lay out your arms. Weren't you listening? As I've always said, you came to challenge the demigods and their god. To slay them. And as long as you do, I will always smith your weapons. It is what I wish. To smith a weapon for you to slay a god. I see. Oh, is that right? So Master Hugh won't listen to you either. You have my thanks regardless. I'll try and talk him round next time. I know he was given this great entreaty to craft a weapon which could slay a god. Though I can't help but think of it as a curse. A fearsome curse. Put on him by Queen Marika. And if that's the case, I'm not sure there's anything we can do. You burned the earth tree, didn't you? Then the round table is soon to follow. Ah, no need to fret about that. The round table holds served to put a tarnished upon the throne of Elden Lord. And if the earth tree needed to burn for that to happen, then the round table must go as well. I'll stay at the round table for a time. I must learn all that can be taken from this place and sear it into my memory. How could I call myself the all-knowing if I did any less? The pursuit of knowledge is without end. For knowledge is never a thing complete. Thus, I maintain the mantle of all-knowing. Perhaps the same could be said of guidance. Who is to say whether we'll remain who we are once the fight is finished? What do you think? As one who aspires to become Elden Lord, 